Look at these bags. I'm no fashionista, but I love the story behind these bags. Let's meet the man who chased his dreams and birthed clone bags. So, stand by. Hi, I'm Eugene. Welcome to Clone. So Eugene, tell me what Clone is all about. Uh, Clone is actually a, a platform where we actually require customers to bring their own carriers uh, to us and we will reconstruct um, bags into any kind of design for our customers. My dream is to always uh, to own a local fresh fashion brand. Yeah, so I, I didn't try to go towards that, that, that direction immediately because uh, firstly, you need, if you want to go into a fashion brand, you need to know how to make. So I didn't want to make my own product first because I don't know whether is it going to be a green light that I'm going to go this all the way. So I get my mom to help me to make the product that I want. So I started uh, using the IKEA materials first. Despite having a stable job in the corporate world, Eugene quit his then job and daringly made a bold decision to chase after his dreams, which he has little knowledge about. I find that uh, not sure what the future will be. Uh, is, it, is it going to be working throughout my whole life? Uh, like there isn't an aim, there isn't an end point. So I decided to leave uh, the corporate world to start uh, entrepreneurship. I, I'm always into fashion. I, I, like to, uh, I like to see, I like to, uh, I like to see and I like to really mix and match uh, whatever that I wear or even look at people dressing since young. Yeah, so um, there is always something uh, that, you know, that I have in, in, in me that it doesn't ignite out. After when I go into the fashion business, uh, then, uh, wow. The challenges I face are like uh, making physical bags, uh, the getting the idea right, and also leaving a uh, corporate world to go into entrepreneurship right, is not uh, an easy choice. And, and that I, I, I have never saved enough capital to get out of my comfort zone. So, and my wife also giving birth at the same time. No doubt this is a very small scale business. But Eugene still ensures that the quality control is of the best. The shop also needs to pay rent and all this. We need to always think of uh, new ideas every day. And we come to certain bum or certain rocky roads. Uh, we receive a lot of complaints from like uh, bags issues, uh, quality control issues. Yeah, this, these are the problems which are the very uh, serious issue that we, I have. I, I have to face every day. Yeah. Then uh, coming up with a new design, it needs to be every day. Yeah. Because of uh, social media impression. Yes. Then um, a lot of this kind of problem, right? I always uh, find one, 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 one area or one place to hide. Yeah. But uh, I am really appreciated when I actually propose this idea to my mom that uh, should we come out and do this business, to run this business. She taught me how to use the sewing machine. Without her kickstart, right, I, I wouldn't even, I think I wouldn't even touch the machine. Yeah. The only moment that she motivates me uh, is the moment that she decided to come out and run this business with me. I know of people like Eugene, who risk everything just for the sake of their dreams. Juggling between financial stability and chasing your dreams 
isn't an easy thing, but yet, he still went on with it. For this, he deserves my utmost respect. The, the biggest dream that I have always wanted throughout the whole fashion journey, eh? I want to, I hope to be able uh, to collaborate with some of the big brands. Following your dream is easier said than done. I myself am only just beginning to realize my dream in life. Ultimately though, we only have one life and we must make the most out of it. Check out Clone at Far East Plaza or visit their Facebook and Instagram page. If you enjoyed the video, do give me a like. Share it with your friends and subscribe to Singapore One to stay updated on what we are doing. Until the next time, this is City Joe Bruce, chasing dreams at Far East Plaza for Singapore One.